bit of bull bash vodka. Not so the best of Belarusian vodka. I personally prefer Takaya Utka, but see, it is as it is in the provinces. So anyway guys, cheers. Oh, I have to admit, that bull bash is rough. Mr. Bald is right. So Novin Gotham, Happy New Year everybody. I've commenced my provincial travels. The first of 2021. All right, tell you where we are guys. We are here in Smorgon. We're approximately 110 kilometers northwest of Minsk after a two hour train journey amidst the snow. And I'm 70 cents lighter for the journey. Okay, so let's try and find my hotel. I'm gonna make some announcements guys. I forgot my winter boots and I have no long johns. And the roads here are extremely treacherous. All right, let's try and find my hotel, check in, see if I don't kill myself on the footpaths. Oh, geez. Wow, check this out guys. Look at this for ice. Check if I'm on the right street. Come Smolsk. I think I am. Wow. Some very nice houses here. Okay. Let's move on. Let's check in. Let's find my hotel. Let's go straight there. It's freezing cold. And I, I think I forgot my gloves as well. Okay, dudes, found my hotel. Gostanisa Smorgon. All right, let's check in. As we can see here in Belarus, when you enter a building, you must wear a mask. So that's since the 16th of November, and the minibar is closed. What a disaster. Anyway, let's put on my Mexican beer mask. A lot better. Okay, let's check out my room. That's administration. Okay, let's check it out. It's 31, 32. All right, 33. Let's see what earthly delights await. Okay, this is the room that I paid about 130 rubles for. That's approximately $40 or 40 euros for two nights. So check it out. There we go. There is the king size bed. There's a mirror here. Hmm, nice chair. Well, we even got a mini bar. Well, there's nothing in it. So not quite a mini bar. Okay, TV, oh, Belarusian, Horizon Television. Got the internet here. Oh, this is where we put our clothes. So we have wardrobe here, blankets. All right, so wardrobe, nice and spacious wardrobe. We can put our stuff into. All right, let's move in then into the kitchen. Wow, even got a kitchen here. Check it out, folks. This is actually like a typical Soviet apartment. Fridge, Atlanta Belarusian fridge, of course, is not plugged in. I'll plug it in later on. Table with some crockery, probably some of the finest Dobrush crockery there. We've got a couch, a chair in case you want to entertain some guests. And lo and behold, folks, we even have a balcony. Wow, not too bad, not too shabby. Yeah, not much of a view. 
What's well, Morgan? So it's the night time, Saturday night. Okay, let's go in. Let's go back in. It's quite cold outside. All right, so. All right, guys, now. Peace de la, de la resistance. It's time for the toilet. Let's see what they have in the toilet. Yeah, Ooh, not too bad. Very nice. Check out the shower. Very, very modern shower. Unlike the normal Soviet hotels that I've normally stayed in. Doesn't have anything like this. Even my own apartment doesn't have anything like this. This place is better than my own apartment. Heater, toilets, and of course, the sink. Hot water. We have got some soap. And in case you smell the following morning. All right. Excellent. We'll have to say, guys, not bad for less than 40 euros for two nights in Smorgon. Yeah, okay. All right, guys. So I'm going to unpack and I'm hungry. So let's go for a bite to eat. All right, guys, just been informed that there's a restaurant near here, a cafe near here, a place of mieste, which means together. So, I'm hungry, let's check it out. And as you can see, it's Saturday night in Smorgon. This place is bustling, a bustling metropolis. You're probably watching this in the middle of a lockdown. And as you know, in Ireland, we have a level five lockdown, which means everywhere is closed within a five kilometer radius. No restaurants, no cafes, no bars. But here in Belarus, cafes, bars, restaurants, all open. Everything is like normal. However, you have to wear the dreaded Mexican beer mask. It is quite bad here, the Mexican beer, the Rona, Wuhan virus. Hospitals and clinics are actually quite busy. People are taking precautions. And they're wearing masks. And a lot of the businesses, hotels, restaurants, cafes, they won't leave you in without a mask. We found it on Soviet Sky Street. Cafe Miesta. Cafe together. All right, hungry folks, let's go in for a bite to eat. A late night. Let's have a nightcap before bed. Здравствуйте, добрый вечер. Место есть? Хорошо. Спасибо. Okay guys, just, uh, this is what I've ordered here. So I have some chips, kartoffel fry, filet petitzi, chicken fillet, with some cheese and some pineapple. And of course guys, to wash it down, a bit of bulbash vodka. Not so the best of Belarusian vodka. I personally prefer to Kaya Utka, but see, you gotta do what you gotta do. It is as it is in the provinces. So anyway, guys, cheers. Oh, I have to admit, that bull bash is rough. Mr. Bald is right. Anyway, cheers. I'm going to enjoy my meal. According to uh, one of the locals I just talked to, Miesta Cafe is meant to be the liveliest cafe in Smorgon. But Smorgon only has about 30, 32,000 people. So, hmm, and the looks of it, 10 at 10 p.m. Not many people here. That's Vidania.
if you ever want to know where the misspent youth of Smorgon spend their Saturday nights, it's right here in the main square. All right, guys, let's beat a retreat back to the hotel. It's 11 p.m. It's time to go back. We have a long day tomorrow to explore what Smorgon has to offer us. Bloody hell, I think I'm lost.